This is a site that loves travel stop, hopes to secure in Louisa County in the coming months. The potential location of the truck stop and convenience store is alongside Cross Country Road or Route 522 in Gum Spring. It's a 52 acre piece of property near Interstate 64, just over a mile from the Goochland County line. The potential project is creating controversy amongst people in the area. From signs to a petition and over 100 people packing a room to share their opinions. I would say most of us do not want this here for very good reason. Love staff heard those concerns from Louisa and Goochland residents at a neighborhood meeting they held Wednesday night. I don't care what answers you give, we don't want you. That meeting is a requirement for loves in the process of acquiring a permit. We're your neighbors, right? I mean, we're, we're not bringing in a bunch of people from out of state to come in here and work this thing. I mean, Some express concerns about the impact additional traffic coming into the area would put on law enforcement and fire rescue agencies. They say Louisa County could have to rely on Goochland County since Goochland's agencies are closer to the proposed location than any in Louisa. I find it very disturbing that you haven't done any research into fire, rescue, and police response. Other people express concerns on how it would impact the quality and quantity of water supply in Louisa. Can you guarantee with 100% certainty that your child stop is not going to affect the quality of our well water? Love staff members responded to each question. They deferred the handling of law enforcement responses to the county, but said they were required to present their plans to first responders, who they say only provided one piece of feedback. They also cited water studies done that show the area had enough water for them to not impact residents, and say they have robust procedures and precautions in place to prevent environmental hazards. We are held to the highest standard um, that the, the state requires. It's in our best interest to make sure that we're not creating issues with water, to make sure that we have water and that we're not affecting it. So. We're doing everything that we are required to. No one in attendance spoke out in favor of the project, with a majority sharing they don't believe this project is compatible with the wants of the community. You guys are here about your business. Right. And we want your business to see that this is our home, man. That's right. This is our home. Okay, so. The Planning Commission will hear the proposal for this site at their meeting on August 8th. They're able to either deny it, defer it, or approve it. And if they approve it, it'll then move to the Board of Supervisors who will ultimately have the final say. And Louisa, I'm Maggie Marshall, CBS 6 News.